could get a glossy magazine or one of Rupert Murdoch's yeah, latest wives. I often see a lot of criticism of older men marrying younger women. But if you look at women, they develop sooner than men do. They're on a different level. They're like fine wine. They go through different stages in their life. Hormonal changes and all this sort of stuff. So if a man marries a woman that's the same age, I mean, it's not always the case, but quite often, 10 years down the track, the man looks at the girl, rolls over and he's like, who did I marry? She's changed. Especially, you know, when there's a similar age gap between the man and the woman. So all this criticism that we see of men marrying younger women is just silly. It's hypocrisy. I mean, you never hear a woman complain that, you know, we say that they mature earlier or anything like that, but the moment the man marries a younger girl so that he can be with someone that's on his level, all of a sudden that's a problem. I had a young gentleman that actually wrote to me recently and he was going on about, you know, my sex pack video and all these men that come over here and prey on girls that are, you know, 10 or 20 years younger. And I had a bit of a giggle because there's very little praying that goes on. And to be completely honest, if there is praying going on, often it's um, it's the other way around, you know, with the cat calls here in Cambodia. But what is the ideal age gap, you know, for a man and a woman? And I think that women are about 10 years ahead of men. So for a man to find a partner that's about 10 years younger makes complete sense. And it's funny because when they do that, often the girls that are the same age will complain about it. You know, they'll, they'll get all offended. They'll call him a creepy old man and all this sort of stuff. But you never ever hear them complain, thought of as being more advanced than the men. But when you talk to them about yeah, the idea of actually marrying a younger woman, all of a sudden that's a problem. You also see the same thing with older women. Like, you know, Elizabeth Taylor, for instance, had a lot of young lovers and stuff like that. And she copped a lot of flack in the tabloids. So, I think it's a bit of yeah, hypocrisy. I just wanted to mention this because, yeah, not being married myself, it's something that just crosses my mind. Because, I mean, I'm very immature. I have no problem admitting that. You know. Love is love, right? We have a new sign going up here at, uh, at Ostex. It's very impressive. So there you go.